Hello guys, Lifehackster here. I've been looking for a small camera bag for my camera vlogging type setup. I have a small camera backpack, but this is too big if I just want to take my Sony ZV-E10 or my ZV-1, a mic, a couple of batteries, and a vlogging tripod. So I searched at Amazon and I decided to get a sling bag from Hex. And this is the Hex Ranger Camera Mini Sling. And I like the Glacier Camo Color in design. A little branding here that says Hex, and for this small, it has a lot of pockets. We have a small pocket here in the front, and it is padded and will fit your phone or wallet. Behind it is also a padded, much bigger zippered pocket. Will fit your camera chargers, cables, mesh pocket for extra batteries, and we have a removable keyring, which is nice. And we have the main compartment, and there is a mesh pocket in the flap, so more storage options. We have a couple of dividers, uh, different sizes, and I guess this one is for the bottom so that it will hold its shape. Hex stated that this has a 2.5 liter capacity, which is perfect for my point and shoot and even my mirrorless APS-C cameras. Strap is pretty good and is adjustable. On the bottom, we have a couple of straps to hold like a small tripod. Let's fill this up and see what we can put in. This is the one camera setup that I usually bring to a day trip with the exception of the battery charger and the power bank. I'm more than fine with a battery in the camera and two spare ones, but we will see how much we can put in. My Sony ZV-E10 first with my 11mm 1.8 lens and this is mostly for vlogging. Fits no issues. And I also bring the kit lens 16 to 50. And for the mic, I have my Rode Video Micro 2 with a windscreen. It is a pretty compact mic. We still have some space here, but we will close this and place the batteries on the other pocket. In here, I can put in my SD cards, the two spare batteries, battery charger with its cable, and let's close this up. In the front, we can put in the power bank and just have to remove the cable and it fits. In the main compartment, there is still space to put my phone if I wanted to. And close this up, nice. And for my vlogging tripod, which is the Mantis Pod 2.0, I'll just hook this up on the outside bottom straps. Pull the straps to tighten and secure it in place. That's it. All right, so this is mostly advertised as a crossover sling bag, which works great. But one advantage of a sling bag compared to a regular backpack is that if you want access to the bag, you just flip this like so, and you can just open it without removing it from your shoulder. Compared to a backpack, you have to remove it so that you can open up the backpack. But this one, you can do your thing, take a photo, and zip it up again, and you're ready to go. But one other cool thing that uh, this is why I got the uh, mini sling bag is that I just have to shorten the straps which you can easily do by the way. All right, now this time, it is now a fanny pack or a butt pack. Cool. Anyways, that's it for this video. Thanks for watching.